Do you want all-in-one hacking tool? Today, I want to share something I stumbled upon during my usual GitHub exploration. A hidden gem that's perfect for beginners wanting to dip their toes into ethical hacking. It's called AL Hacking, and it's designed to simplify the learning process while still packing a punch with its features. Before we go any further, a quick but important disclaimer. Everything in this video is for educational purposes only. The tools and techniques I'm about to show you are meant for learning and ethical exploration, nothing else. If you misuse this, you're on your own. Let's keep it legal and responsible, okay? With that out of the way, let's dive in. What is AL hacking? AL hacking is a lightweight tool built entirely in shell scripting, making it efficient, portable, and compatible with almost any operating system. What's cool about it is that it's a beginner-friendly way to explore ethical hacking concepts without requiring deep technical expertise up front. Here's a quick overview of what AL hacking offers. Simulated social media hacking, phone number information gathering, Gmail attack simulations, sending anonymous SMS, webcam hacking, and a powerful DOS attack simulation. And guess what? You can even run this tool on your phone if you don't have access to a computer. It's incredibly versatile. Setting up AL hacking. Let me walk you through how to get AL hacking up and running on your system. It's a simple process that even a complete beginner can follow. Open your terminal. I like to keep my tools organized, so I use a folder called hacking underscore tools. Feel free to name your folder whatever you like. Go to the GitHub repository. Head over to the GitHub page for AL hacking and copy the repository link. Clone the repository. In your terminal, navigate to your folder and type git clone repository link. This will download the tool to your local system. Navigate to the folder. Use the cd command to move into the tools directory. cdl underscore hacking. Launch the tool. Finally, type bash al underscore hack dot shake and just like that the tool is ready to go. Exploring al hacking. When you launch al hacking you'll see a menu. While the menu is primarily in Albanian, don't let that intimidate you, it's pretty straightforward to understand. For instance, option 1, updates the tool, super handy for keeping everything up to date. Option 2, phishing simulations, using a tool called Z Fisher. If you've been around in the ethical hacking space, you've probably heard of it. It's one of the most popular phishing tools out there. Let me show you an example of how easy this tool is to use. Type 11 and press enter. AL hacking will take care of the rest. Downloading, installing, and launching without you lifting another finger. It's an absolute breeze. What makes AL hacking stand out isn't just its features, it's the simplicity. The tool automates tasks that would normally take a lot of setup giving beginners a chance to focus on learning rather than getting bogged down in technicalities. However, here's an important note. While tools like AL Hacking are great for learning, they're just the tip of the iceberg. If you're serious about ethical hacking, you need to go deeper, learn how these tools work behind the scenes, explore shell scripting, networking, and cybersecurity concepts. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, Drop a comment below and let me know what other tools or topics you'd like me to cover. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps me keep creating content like this for you. Until next time, happy learning, stay ethical, and I'll see you in the next video.